Welcome back everyone. You may be stuck in a situation where your Samsung phone is stuck on a charging screen like this. Maybe it's not this exact type of screen for me, it was a little bit different, but it looks like a panel like this and I was experiencing this on my Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus, not this specific Samsung Galaxy S8. And I don't know if this is a problem with older Samsungs, but pretty much how I was able to fix it, and it's very weird, was that basically I had to reboot it into its basically like its reboot screen which is very weird so basically i'll go ahead and try turning off my phone here so i'll go ahead and power it off and pretty much what i had to do was i had to hold down the volume up button and the power button at the same time but only after i plugged it into charge so i would essentially go ahead so once the phone was fully powered off typically when i unplugged it it was powering off and it was not allowing me to do anything else what i had to do was as I plugged in my charger at the bottom, I was holding the power up button and the volume up button at the same time until the phone got into its like reboot panel. So you'll know what it is as soon as you see it. So what I did was I just kept holding down these buttons and sooner than later, the phone will get into a different type of panel, but I don't think this one, but maybe it only works if it's, you know, actually inside of, you know, plugging it in. But basically after I got into that panel, it allowed me to select reboot system. And all you have to do is use the volume down and up buttons to pretty much reboot system. And then you click the power button or the left button here to actually reboot it. And that's really all you have to do. Sometimes you may get lucky and you may actually just be able to hold the volume up button and the power button at the same time, plug in the charger at the bottom, and it may just end up working in and of itself. I don't think that works 100%. I don't think it's a guarantee, but it is another thing you can do. So you can hold the volume up button and the power button. And I've also heard that you can hold the volume down button and the power button at the same time too. And that may end up fixing it for you too. Again, it's not a guarantee, but it's the one thing that helped it for me and that actually just ended up happening to me like two to three days ago and it ended up fixing it. So that's pretty much the process. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.